Red Cedar Foxes. This is WRCE, your Foxes Morning News. I am Miley. And I am Brendan. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for the South Carolina Pledge. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. Now for the South Carolina Pledge. I salute the flag of South Carolina and pledge to the Palmetto State, love, loyalty, and faith. Today is Thursday, November 29th, and we want to wish Kalima a very happy birthday. This holiday season, our school is participating in a pajama drive to benefit children living in local shelters. Scholastic book clubs will match every new pair of pajamas our school collects with a brand new book in order to give children in need a warm and reassuring bedtime. Because good nights help make good days. If your family would like to participate, please send a new pair of pajamas sizes 8 and up to, to school by December 14th. Tomorrow and Monday are spirit shirt days. And interims go home tomorrow. Now here is Kylie and Grace with the fun holiday. Every year since 1933, an evergreen tree plucked from its spot in New York or Vermont, Ohio, or Pennsylvania, or even Canada, is erected at 30 Rockefeller Plaza. Plaza. It is trimmed with the hundreds of ornaments and thousands of colorful lights, and topped with a star, and on selected day after Thanksgiving, it is lit for the world to see. The tree must exceed 65 feet to be selected for the honor of gracing Rockefeller Center. The tallest tree selected was a 100-foot Norway spruce from Killingworth, Connecticut. Each year, the tree is donated to various organizations. In years past, the tree has been ground into mulch and donated to the Boy Scouts of America to be sold to fund projects. Recently, Habitat for Humanity has been a benefactor of the great tree for use in construction of homes. The Rockefeller Center Christmas tree lighting ceremony has become a national tradition going back to the day of the Great Depression. On Christmas Eve of 1931, a group of construction workers erected a small spruce Christmas tree on site that would become the Rockefeller Center. Since then, it had become a national event, including skating, pageants, live entertainment, and television specials. Now here is our weather forecast. Today will be mostly sunny and warmer with the highs in the lows to mid-60s. It will be mostly clear tonight with lows in the low 40s. Friday will be mostly sunny with highs near 70. Remember to work hard, be kind, and show respect. Have a fox-tastic day, and we'll see you right back here tomorrow morning.